All righty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Sing Bros TV. You know, you got the boy Nar. You got the boy Simron. My bad. What's up, man? How's it going? <laughs> How are you? Chilling, bro. Here, drinking my drink. You know, we always have guests on our on our show. We thought we have three this time. Hey. <laughs> Introduce yourself, you guys. What's up? It's uh, it's Avi. Hey, it's my boy Avi, straight from Texas. Yo. Yo. From <laughs> 18 hours for. Well, 18 hours? Yeah, 18, 19 hours. Both y'all drove, right? Yeah. I didn't drive. No. You did, yeah. I didn't drive. You just swept. I don't drive either. Yeah, I swept. I swept. Yeah. <laughs> cool, cool. Somebody yeah, has yeah. to do that too. Basically. Right. <laughs> what about you, Pablo? Introduce yeah. yourself. My name is Pablo. Uh, I'm from Colón, Panama. And uh, yeah, I grew up in Phoenix, so I'm here. Hey. You know, back home. I heard you play basketball too, right? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Go ahead. Just yeah. tell me a little bit about that. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Before we get into that, let's introduce I'm not a person, bro. Yeah, I'm not a person. True, true, true. My fault, my fault. Go ahead. Go what, ahead. Go what ahead. What is you doing? No, How sorry, is you going to forget him? I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm main sorry. Guess. Go ahead, bro. Main guest. Oh, it's Navi. I'm Navi. You're Navi? Yeah. Hey, this, this is Avi's brother. Yeah. yeah. Tell so, us. For some reason, bro. For some reason. For some, some, some odd reason. Some reason. For some reason. Like, I don't want to be here. <laughs> I don't want to be his brother. <laughs> <laughs> move out, move out, there's never more problems. Yeah. <laughs> nah, he should. <laughs> so, Pablo, so what, far, up, bro. what up with you, man? How are you playing basketball too, right? I do. Uh, I just graduated from North Carolina Central, so I played there two years, uh, won back to back championships. Uh, it was the greatest experience ever. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's what's up. You won back to back? Yeah, that made me a winner, so. You know, and then after that, I uh, went to play overseas, I just got done playing in Spain, so. Just chilling right now. Okay. Yeah. I like it. How, how long were you in Spain for? I was just Spain for like a whole year. A whole year. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What's it like? It was pretty good. It's pretty good. Barcelona, pretty lit. You, <laughs> yeah. know, was, you know, the parties and all the situations. But you know, Barcelona was just it was a great city. So had some fun and uh, you know the basketball wise, uh, it was very comparative. You know, different players, different atmosphere. You know, different crowds. So you know, you had to adapt. But I still produce. What's so, um? Is it better playing it overseas or like local here? Uh, um, give the mic a little bit closer to you. Yeah, yeah. overseas. Uh, maybe overseas because it's more like you know realistic. You know, like out here, more like you know based on politicism and stuff like oh, that. You should freeze. But like overseas, you will see pretty much a little bit of everything. So, so like a little, it's a whole different culture. It's everyone there. Nice. Yeah, not everyone like just the support. Like you know, it's a di different atmosphere. Just like the crowd get more into it. You know, like it just pretty much like defense all game instead oh, of yeah. you know defense just in the fourth quarter. Yeah. You know, like it's it's a it's that type of basketball. So you know? you're running back and forth the entire yeah, time. Yeah, pretty just, much. Not, not just, in the, just in like the running sets. And yeah, yeah, like yeah. I feel. I feel. So you're, not, yeah. you're not like Curry, right? Only uh, in the fourth quarter when nah. he goes off. <laughs> nah, nah, man. I go off the whole game. So. He goes off only second half. He'll be playing like shit. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He does not play like shit. He, but the second off, shot. second yeah. half, he just goes like go tomorrow. He goes off. Yeah. For so, sure. What's the crowd like? Is it the crowd more hyped over there or is it more hyped here? Uh, more hyped over there. I feel like, you know, usually you hear a lot of whistles and stuff like that, a lot of boos if he was doing great and you at the, at the way games, you know, the opposite, you know, Jim Arena whatsoever. So I feel like out here, like, you know, people get drunk and just go to the game. So people just chill. Like, yeah, you know. here we only go to the game to be out of the house. No, we don't really. Okay, if you took me to the Suns game, I don't really think I would be watching the game. I would just be there for the atmosphere. Well, so I, I feel like I feel like, be, ball, I feel ball, like that's because, you know, ball. you're playing with the Suns. I mean, I mean, we, the Suns out here, you feel me? So if we was like the Celtics or maybe like, you know, a good team, like the Golden State Warriors, sure. it would be worth sure. the ticket, good team, you know, damn. to go see. A good team. But, good like, team. Damn. Just... You know, but that I'm talking about <laughs> the Phoenix Suns was good a couple of years ago. You know, we all know that, and uh, like we just had to say that they just suck now. Like, you know what I mean? We've had, oh a, we've had we've had decent players come and go. We just I don't know. We still have Devin Booker, like just, just because of Devin Booker. Franchise. Overall, it's still a good game to go watch. If you're ever in Phoenix trying to watch a game, always go watch the Suns. I'll be supporting the Suns. They want exactly. three out of four. Hey, if y'all gonna yeah. watch the Suns, you know, buy an extra ticket for us. You know, go with y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Show y'all how it's done. <laughs> we so Nar, I have something that I need to bring up. What's up, bro? Luis is eight, right? Yeah. And I told you we was gonna make a mess. <coughs> yeah. Who was the first one to make a mess? Me, bro. Low key. So I look over. He's eating his burger, right? 
All I see is ranch and mayo all over. No, this shit was just, mm. it was just mad, bro. Like, I was so embarrassed, though. I was like, hey, nobody saw this. Tell, <laughs> let's me why, get it. tell me why I had that prediction. I was like, yo, let's go eat downstairs. If we make yeah. a mess, we'll clean it. They're like, nah, no, let's just eat here. I'm like, okay, you guys are grown guys. You guys won't make a mess. Okay. And, <laughs> and, and you like, no that's why ain't you, ain't you, ain't you 21? Hey, 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 chill, chill, chill. <laughs> inside of the rap, you know, you got me inside, uh, eating inside that's, of the rap. Exactly, <laughs> can't open the whole rap. Hey, eating that, lessons one on one here. All that food dripping and stuff, that just means that burger was juicy, bro. That shit was, that shit was yeah, it's the just spot. McDonald's, my nigga. Like, hey, it was still hitting shit, the spot, bro. Shit. What you mean? <laughs> yeah, just for a little certain amount of time. Right. That's, yeah. what, done, what, that's what it does. Yeah, just, just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Over time. Over time. <laughs> totally. But now, hey, on, on the real though, what's one of your guys' biggest pet peeves that you guys have? Like, about anything. For me, honestly, it's... Time. Time. <laughs> no, time. Oh. If, if, you don't, if you went off, oh, bro, yes. if you don't respect time, <laughs> Time won't respect you. That's all it is. Right. Right? Like, what the fuck are you doing? Like, if you got somewhere to be, yes, okay. At times, I fuck up too. But the the thing I like to, I don't like to do is keep people waiting. Right. Yeah. That's my biggest pet peeve. If, if you tell me, let's just say, if you tell me you're on your way, and you're still like 30 minutes away, bro, yeah. oh, I'm gonna be so fucking heated at you. Right. So, typical Indian but, stuff? Typical well, Indian honestly, shit, yeah. yeah. Uh, I was about to say that. Y'all do that all the time on Fortnite. Oh, <laughs> oh, you, oh that's we, Fortnite, we, 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 that's we, we, we. Not, not, not just, not just, that's, that's, just, that's not even just India. That's just Panamanian, too. We do take a long time. We on our way. We, we but honestly, ready. I think you know it's just because, like, back out there, you got so much free time, bro. Like, you got so much time on your hands, you don't have to get to anything, like, immediately. True. Like, out here, it, like, life's like so it. fast. Oh, yeah. yeah. Everything, yeah, everything out here moves hella quick. Oh, yeah. I mean, over there, too, I don't know what you mean by that. Like, there, people do have a lot of free time, but... Uh, <laughs> just go to anybody's house and just be like, you know, make some job type shit. True. <laughs> Thanks. Go ahead, answer it, go ahead, answer No, it's true, it's my mom. Go tell her, tell her what's up. I'll text her. Yeah, yeah. Just Didn't text she do this like two days ago on Saturday? So, and on Saturday, he calls. He's like, hey, I'm outside. I'm like, alright, cool. <laughs> I go outside. I'm like standing out there for a good two minutes. I see his car come in. <laughs> Bro, two I minutes. Into the neighborhood when I text him. That's, that's, like, that's normal. normal. Bro, that's normal. That's normal. Yo, okay. neighborhood has like a lot of turns. Man. Damn, you know. Yeah, he's not that bad. It's not. It's not. It's really not that bad. Nice it's so big, Texas, that bro. Amazing. Texas. Yeah. It's terrible. Yeah, it's there's a lot of open area. Before when we moved out here, there was nothing. Yeah, it was. Oh yeah, yeah. that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we talking about roads and shit now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anything and everything, right? But hey, for real, though, for real, bro. What is this podcast about, bro? No, no, I want to. I want to go back to your question. So no, I want to. I want you to tell me what this podcast is about, so everyone knows first. Okay, so this podcast <laughs> is gonna be about. Everything and nothing. So we're just gonna keep it real. Whatever we have in our mind, whatever we need to get off. Exactly. We're gonna get it off right here, right now, with these three guys. Bro. So back right to your there. question. Back to my question. What's your biggest pet peeve, bro? My biggest pet peeve. Yeah, something to to do with Nar, bro. I would to, do, to do. Why would it be? Wow. I, would, why would I already I know. It. I already know it. Cause it's it's the same with with me and Obi, bro. So he's your biggest pet peeve. It's what he does, yes. Yeah, what, what he does. What he does, bro. It's it's every time. Example. Every time we're in the car, bro. All right. He doesn't let me. He, he plays what chosen. He, so he, he, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> but but. That's but, but <laughs> Nobody loves that song. He'll be singing. I hate y'all, but. The thing is, whenever we're in the car, he don't let me play music, bro. He plays nothing but you know, to do, got an algebra and all that bro, stuff. Like, like I, I just want one song. This boy's like, nah, bro. Like, like I'm driving you, bro. Come on now. I, like, I just I try to play music he likes, but shit, I'm driving. It's my car, bro. True. Right. He just be. He just feel like he he on the off. Exactly. You know what I mean? like, that's that's just exactly. Yeah. But I think that's what everybody. Says. If I'm driving my car, it's my music. Yeah, but the thing is, he's always my driver. So the thing is, I I do it to like. Why, bro? Why you hey You got a you got a driver ready for you, bro. I want to drive. You, 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 you act like people gotta pay for that. But you act like hey, 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 well, I mean, hey, every, like you, yeah. you've seen like ten-year-olds drive. Yeah. You, know, you, still, you still have your little. Uh, what? 
what's it called those little wheels that are on the back door. Sporty training wheels. wheels. Yeah, the training, training wheels. wheels. Ha ha ha. Uh, no, not cell phone. Sporty wheels. <laughs> sporty wheels. <laughs> I, was like, I had it in my head. I was like, I just had it. Bro, it happens. It happens. Like racing cars, are you? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I was like, what the fuck? What's your biggest pet peeve about him? About him. What irritates you? Yeah. That's just going back and forth. For real, like y'all like shit. Just that thing with little brothers, how they're like just annoying sometimes. Annoying, right? I, bro, I, I swear I try my best not to annoy him. Yeah, your mom doesn't come and just yell at the younger one. I don't know. <laughs> she, she, she yells at the older one. This morning, so he had his day off, right? This morning, uh, it was like 11.30. I was like, Mom, he's still sleeping. Mom's like, he got no note, kid. Yeah, but, yeah. I was like, if I'm sleeping past 12 or even past 10, you're like, Simran, Simran. Yeah, you lazy fuck. Yeah. Okay, yeah. She was just like, what is he going to do if he even wakes up? Yeah. Okay. Exactly, that, that 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 happens a lot, bro. Especially holiday. like especially like if it's late night and I'm still on my phone and you are, she, she won't come into my room until she comes into yours first. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> talking about this. <laughs> How did this go? <laughs> this is stupid off topic, nigga. <laughs> Where did we go from? <laughs> Why are we going from? about when your mom comes to wake you up? And not you, nigga. No. <laughs> We that's talked a, about that cut. That's a cut. <laughs> that's a cut. Oh yeah, my that's, god. That's a cut. cut. <laughs> y'all went from pet peeves to that. No. Right. Hey, y'all went from my pet peeves to freaking road talks. What the fuck? Yeah, that's <laughs> like, true. Y'all went through like going. construction and shit. Right. Ooh, <laughs> random. Man. It's gonna be random podcast. Pablo, what about random. you, dog? Pet peeves. Pet peeves. Oh man. When somebody doesn't pass you the ball. That's one. <laughs> Knowing that I'm yeah. cooking. You feel me? Knowing yeah. that I'm cooking, then you, now you try to just show off. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Man, just let me get the rock with the game. You know what I'm saying? Like, just like that. That's one of my pet peeves, but um, that's just basketball wise. Yeah. Uh, what about like just general? General shit. You know, like you said, like what's your time? That's one. Like you know, like I, I kind of feel that, but um, just. The lack of loyalty, you know, like, that's another thing. Like most people, like they tell you, like you know, they love you and stuff like that, and will do shit fake. for you. It's all fake face, love, bro. Yeah, that's all it is. It's fake love. Pet peeve. So you, you know, what I'm saying you can just hear anyone say tell you something that they're gonna do, and they, they just don't do it. But I think that's what everybody. They'll show you. They're like they, they're like so loyal to you that they fuck with you yeah. heavy and shit. But behind your back, they're still gonna be talking shit. Well, hey, like, honestly, peeve. they'll always so, be I, like. Fake hey, people, bro. Facts. Just how I, it saw, is. I saw a motivational hey, video today. Hold on, no, no, no. Legit. He was like, hey, I don't care how many uh, like followers you might have. You might have like 50 million followers. Half of those followers, they going to follow you just because they love you. They respect what you're doing. They want to see you grow. The other half, they want to see you fuck up. They want you to drop. And then that's when they come out. That's when they don't. That's the people that oppose shit. That's the people that right. don't talk, right. don't do anything until you mess up. That, those are the people that are like, I told you. you won't exactly. Mm, right. yeah. That's like with everybody. That's like even with. That's like with like every anything actually. You just, anything I feel like that's with that. just anything because right, I feel like, man, like I see, that's, I see it like this. I see it like this, bro. I feel like, man, we we all brought up in this world for the same purpose. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. We all got to do one thing to see. So whenever you do it, however you do it, like that's just go define you who you are. You feel me, like and. There's gonna people that's gonna support that, like that or hate that. You know, like they just they, that's just how it is. And then the people that go like it or hate that, that means still follows you. Like them, the followers. So you just gotta add them all together. You can't even basically split them because it's like some support you for the do to do good, and then some support you to do bad. I think what you need the negativity with the positivity. Because okay, for an example, this happened to me. Okay, I'm not gonna talk. About yeah, don't yeah don't, don't tell us all. <laughs> He ain't trying to bear him to something. No. So, okay. no, no. <laughs> moral of my story is, so if you have something negative with your positive, that's always going to, like, motivate you. Like, if if you or if other people saying, like, yo, your podcast is, like, not good, and this is what you need to do, I wouldn't take it as, like, a, or even if he told you, like, oh, your podcast is not good, your content is not good, I wouldn't take it as a negative. I would take it as a positive. Like, oh, shit. Maybe that's one guy that doesn't like it. Maybe there's more of these guys that don't like what I'm producing, so I need to change what I'm doing. Word. So maybe the negative is not always a negative. It's always a. It could be a positive too. It just depends on how it's you take room it. for improvement, pretty much. Yeah. It's just if you see if the glass is half full or is it half empty. It's just pretty much something like that. Alright. Before I used to be like, if somebody talks shit to me or if anybody was like neg- negative to me, I'd be like, fuck you. I know what you I'm doing. Like you take it in. I would get it like way, so but... hostile, like. 
leave me alone. Like, it's my idea. Like, I know. But now it's as crazy age, shit, because yeah. there's always people trying to get between that. Exactly. Yeah. With now age, I'm like, okay, now I can listen. If Bro, you don't it's because, like, like, negativity is always going to be around. It's just how you react. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, I think, only. like, growing up, you react differently. Mm-hmm. But yeah. when you're, like, at that age, when you're like, all right, it doesn't bother that's, me anymore. That's honestly just because you're maturing. You're, you're seeing the world. You're seeing what you messed up and how you could fix yourself pretty much room for improvement that's what i was that's what pretty much i was going for too but honestly we got real freaking <laughs> serious right now yeah <laughs> no no this is a good conversation it. Yeah. It, it is a good combo not gonna lie so okay i was thinking about this if you guys had one power yeah. any one power what would that one power be Shit. like if you were to give him one superpower I'll go around. You guys can take your time. And one super Ooh, power. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh that's a good power. one. That's a good one. Yeah. I would take Magneto's powers. Cause like, Why? bro, think about it. Literally anything and everything nowadays is made out of metal. Think about it. He can literally freaking break shit, move shit, do anything with his hand. And then he's got to throw on like a freaking helmet and fly. Yeah, for me, I feel like, oh, teleport. Like, that just, you know what I'm saying? I was going to say I'll something. do that, That's and then, but I can go to different eras, too, which means I can go back to the past, or you know what I'm saying? Well, we'll talk about the eras. I have something about that one. Yeah. <laughs> like, I have a really good one. Yeah, I would so say. That teleport one. That, that teleportation? One. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I dig that. I'd say, idea. like, Iron Man. Iron Man technology and shit. Okay. So you just want yeah. to that really ain't that shit. If you guys hear mine, you guys will be like, yo, what? Mine's not like, I, nothing like superhero. I want to be able to go back one minute in time. Why? So if I fuck up, or if I say something stupid, yeah. I have that one minute of room that I can go back and change it. I just need that one minute. But everything just can't be perfect. True, you but you, you, mistakes exactly, you gotta make Part mistakes to learn. So that's fine, but okay. Bro. I, I'm, there's always gonna be mistakes, but that's just something that I would be like, okay, if I had an extra one minute to go back and rethink my decisions, I feel like that's a power you shouldn't have until like you get 30. <laughs> <laughs> or like you learn to accept After like, 30, okay, you I go made back. a mistake, you know, it happens, shit happens type thing. You know? I don't know, bro. That your shit, life can't be completely perfect. That shit is just dangerous. That's how like you want to get every back second, bro. Yeah, like, I fuck up a lot. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> what in the world? All you see is they're going back every minute. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, I'm like, all you see is just oop, oop. Hey, didn't this shit already happen, bro? Hey, I don't know. Bro, oh you'll be God. swiping on Tinder next time. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh shit, I gotta go back. <laughs> I'm swiping on oh, that. Oh, we. But talking about your era, if you can go back to any era, what era would it be? What in the world? The if you can go back, like, if you could relive your childhood or your. Nah, your nah, this go, age in mm. any era, what era would it be? I go to the era like the dinosaurs. So I want to see what that was. Like. And then dying like two minutes, my man. That has to be within like oh, uh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm only two thousand what before before Christ. Yeah, but shit, a lot happened. You see, bro, we didn't ask no. What his superpower gonna be? He said not. No, damn. I said I I I said I said I was I was gonna say that. But mine's is way more simple, bro. What's just it? to make the Suns good, just to win the championship, <laughs> bro. Just to make a championship, bro. Super power, fool. Yeah, I have the super power to make a single freaking basketball team in the whole world great. No. Yeah. That's terrible. I forget. That's you. Terrible. That was a, I hate exactly. That. That's just terrible. Hey, you wanna run fast? You wanna? <laughs> you you wanna, say that because I'm dead. Can it be some about oh, you? Okay. Like, be some about me? Yeah, because that's not even about you. That's just helping somebody. Yeah. Else. Yeah, that's helping. Yeah. I mean, so, right. Yeah, it's still helping. We know you're a good guy, but yeah. you gotta be selfish sometimes, yeah, bro. Yeah, but like, Think nah, that's so the power that you want for yourself. Yeah, for yourself. I would know, bro. I say teleportation. Why? Huh? Because like. You can teleport anywhere. You can That's play any place. Any why? Why would you want that superhero power? Hey, I want to change mine. After you. After me? Yeah. I don't know. Whatever we trade you. I, 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 I can't. Like, I wanna, I wanna, no, 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 no. I want to trade it. But low key, instead of the Magneto power, the um, adapting <laughs> to anything, pretty much. Be like so. If let's just say if I'm underwater, I can fucking breathe underwater, swim hella fast. If I'm in like a volcano, I just turn into rocks and shit, just like chilling, bro. Big chilling, you know what I mean? No, okay, this is way too much power in your hand. Okay, I'm gonna put, yeah. like, I'm gonna put like way of, I'm gonna narrow it down. If you could have one, <laughs> that's they, that's a good power, bro. Like, Very like, linear. Adapting. It has to be linear. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. That's 
That's it. That's your final. Might as well everybody pick it like two powers. <laughs> two like, powers. Apparently y'all. Y'all, y'all. I mean, it's a superpower thing, bro. Like that's. Come on now. I'm a. There's a lot of super superheroes that do a lot of crazy shit. Like Deadpool, bro. You shoot him, he, you know that shit grow back. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I say next subject. Next no, topic. Next topic. We were, talking, we were already on the next topic. We of of like, back. yeah, about like time and shit. Yeah, we were already yeah. on. Uh, we were already on. Right. He was talking about dinosaurs. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So what would you do? What would I go back? To? Yeah. It, it can uh, be any era. You can do anything. You don't have to be like dinosaurs era. You can do right, whatever. Right, right. I say uh, nineties. Like, like when they're in the nineties though, like the sixties, fifties, yeah, like seventies. Like, what? 90s, like I'm talking like 1990s, either even in America or even back like in India, bro. Like it was just it was crazy. Simpler times, you know. You didn't have technology and shit. 80s. I love, I love the 80s. 80s. Why? Like, end of 80s and beginning of 90s, bro. That's because it was so new. Born. No, no, no. Not, not even care. If I could be 21 or 22 in the early 90s, music was great. Yeah. Everything was amazing. We had like no drama, no technology, like he's saying. We would actually be out in the fields playing and everything like that. Yeah. But I just want to go back pretty much for the music wise. Like, music was the shit back then. Yeah. Like, everything meant something. That's what I would want to do. For all kind of genres, you could feel me? Like, just all categories that yeah. music was good. Because it was like, even in the music, like, was music, good. Was music good changed too. a lot in like early 2000s. Like, within the 2000s. It changed a lot, yeah. It's we talked about that. I mean, yeah, 2000s we... is low-key lit, too, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's yeah, yeah, good, yeah. good music, wow, but, but like, good music the way it just changed within 10 years was insane. Low-key, I want to go back to my 7th and 8th grade. That's it. Because that, those were times when I was oh, just yeah. chilling, was good bro. Good times like, for me. Good times, bro. Yeah. Like, literally, playground. <laughs> yes, bro, I used to be yes. outside the house every freaking day. I Like, I didn't have a bike then, right? And... My friends would ride their bikes, and I would run next to them, bro. That's when I was, you know, getting my cardio and everything. That shit was so fun, bro. Nowadays, I feel like kids, they just, you know, parents. They play Fortnite. Facts. Yeah. Bro. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Be- before y'all change the topic, let me get a turn. Yeah, bro. <laughs> before this happens again, bro. It's, it's already starting a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, just keep forget- <laughs> you just keep forget about you, bro. Yeah. I'm sorry. Like, I- I'm just waiting the whole time by my own. Okay. You just have to be sorry. Okay. Okay. I, I'm, I'm, just not, I'm just not trying to twist. Speak up. Yeah, but I, on God, I was about to say the same shit as you. Like, yeah. seventh grade, bro. Because seventh grade, <laughs> but seventh grade, bro, like, I had, like, I don't know what you did in seventh grade. Was it just, just like, chill with friends and stuff? I had, like, a D&D club, bro, at school. D&D club? Yeah. What is that? That's, like, Dungeons and Dragons, bro. Like, once a week after school, I would stay after school and we'll play, like, at, like a role-playing game. Where it's, like... And every time we go in, like, a new, like, adventure and shit and shit, like, it was Bro, chill as fuck. I was like, hey, yeah, y'all. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah, yeah. it was just me and my homies, That's cool, bro. That's cool. I didn't, I didn't have all that, bro. All I had was just playgrounds. Yeah, nah, I know, bro. I, know. I had Trust freaking... Me. <laughs> Trust me, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Yeah, parks. Yeah, parks. You said parks? Yeah, yeah. stops. <laughs> nah, we used to be like, if the lights are on, you're outside. Once the light, like, once the sunlight, you're outside. But once the uh, park lights come on, you you have to be inside the house. That was like my rules at my house. Like, like sunset? You yeah. You had to be inside? No, not sunset. As long as, so the minute the light part, the, the minute the light turned on in the park, that's when, that was the time to go home. I mean, nah, like, for How do you not know age, this? You guys are brothers. Bro, age, nah, that didn't happen to me. I was out there for a while. But I mean, I usually came back when it was like sunset time, so. What? My parents really didn't, weren't really strict on him. They were like more on the first time. They are like, gotta fix this one. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta fix this <laughs> He gonna pass, his, pass yeah. the wisdom down. <laughs> oh, that's funny as fuck. But hey, no, um, we were talking about pet peeves, right? I'm about to bring, an, uh, bring up another one, dude. Low key. This is one. Of, this is one of the worst ones. Nah, bro, we bring that shit back. Low key, if I'm taking a female out, and if I tell her, yo, if I ask her what she want, and she don't say nothing, and if I get fries or something, and if she says, yo, let me get a fry, I hate you, cause I asked you what the fuck you want. That's my biggest pet peeve. Don't fucking grab out my food. 
it's just because you guys are fraud? Dude, just no, bro. Like, <laughs> if I'm asking you what you want, like, I'm already paying for it. Why the fuck you, you know, running out of money? You sound like, like a I'm damn old couple are arguing, bro. That, that, that's I'm what you sound like. Hey, hey, hey. Like, if I got food in front of me, don't touch it. No, I'm, I'm how about this? How about this? When the next time you guys go out, if she says she doesn't want anything and you're ordering fries, Order a side of extra fries. Fuck you, that. you know she's gonna get some. Fuck that. Like yeah. she'll make her so much happier. You'll be like, oh. Just make her pay for it though. True. <laughs> sure. Just do that. Hey, I'll be like, hey, hey. Just put have you guys ever yeah. made a girl pay for your dinner? Fuck no. I wouldn't have experience so. Never, yeah. never made a girl pay. You guys never. Yeah. Uh huh. Like no, be honest. Like if you yeah. guys have, you guys have. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> you have. She said I'm proud. Yeah. I have. I, I mean, she proud. she paid she paid she paid for her dinner, but I still pay for mine. You feel me? So right. like that. Yeah, I think yeah, I've done that. Like, no, I have no, done no. that. Mine. Mine. Yeah, I also like you know pay for dinner. That's not a problem with me, but like just. Should, should guys pay for know. first dates? Not first dates. No. Depends on the person. You think guys shouldn't pay for the first dates? Depends on the, the per depends on the person. Cause it could yeah. be just a date that you know somebody trying to get to know each like other. That. Right. I pay for mine. You pay for yeah, yeah. yeah. See, I don't mind that either. Yeah. Low key yeah. on the first date. If it's not something like you like somebody like that you just met, you talking and y'all try to plan something for Friday. You feel right. me? So you be like, okay. They just go to such and such place. Yeah, now man, he just like now. Shit. That's a yeah. I, 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 I don't know. I'm old school. So you so man, you really pay? Yeah, if you're old pay. school, that's different. Like, and then you know, for and school. then what? Like you you know you gonna keep paying for all the days that you gonna go? Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I never thought about it like that. But I'm just like when I go oh, out with a girl. Think about <laughs> it. Oh my fault. You yeah, do. Yeah, bro. You hear me? <laughs> like the first time, I'm just like I don't even care if it's gonna go second date or not. But I'm just like this is me. I'm not gonna let you pay. Even if you pull out your card or anything, I would be like, nah. Just nah. for girls, bro, you, you'll be doing that with us, like, all the time. How about, like, two days ago, bro? We, me and Ovi barely paid for anything. You So you're mad that you didn't pay? No, I'm just saying, like, for you in general, bro, you, you, y'all yeah, always pay, like, pay. Yeah, if the girl paid for you? How would I? I'm, yeah, I would how would you? Like, yo, what the fuck? Like, I, I, I got this. I can pay. Exactly. Would you let I would her? feel weak. Would I let her? Yeah. No, she probably like, won't. Oh, I got this. There's people yeah. that do no, feel no, no. that way too. Yeah. Like, you know, they feel like, okay. No, see, I don't yeah, mind yeah. that. I can afford myself. No, 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 I don't mind that. Like, if you won't say, yo, I'm okay, I'll pay for myself. Cool, no worries. I'll pay for mine. No worries. Right. We can do that. Yeah, But if, she, if you don't say that at all, if you're not bringing nothing up, I'm definitely going to pay for you. Just because oh, yeah. me... I'm just a generous person. I got a big heart, right? And if I'm taking you out, I'm gonna make sure that you know we having fun. We know we chilling. We like I'm. I got it. Like I don't want you stressing about anything. That's but it. No, right, right. To come back to yours, if a girl feels like that, like she's like she feels that I'm violating her space and I'm not letting her pay because of that, I'll be like, no. If you want to pay, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. You and another we thing. We can and do another this. thing you, too, bro. You like, pay for the first date. If we ever go out, I'll pay for the second, or vice versa, I'll pay for the first. If you think I'm hurting your ego, pay for the second one. You can call me, text me, make some plans with me. I'll let you pay for the second one. Another thing, like, girls shouldn't know, like, you know, what's her budget look like. You feel me? Like, yeah. she's not going to say, like, take me to Benny or some right. shit. And then she, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. obviously, like, just she, come on. It's common sense, bro. But it's like, I dig it how people just really different. That's, yeah. that's like, how we are today. Yeah. Like, different cultures in this table right now. You feel me? So it's like, you see how people will react in the first date or like the next couple of days. Cause to me, like in the first date, You're I'll be like, nice you know. The first date. Yeah, obviously. Well, now I'm not gonna no, say no, I'm no, no, the no, next no, one. No, no, I'm not gonna I'm say that. Fuck. Yeah, I'm not gonna say that at all. But yeah. I'm just saying that like, you know, the first day, like I feel like it's gonna be, should be more business, should be more casual. Cause you was like, yeah. you know, you wanna get to know each other before you try yeah, to just start like getting, say, like, you like, know, for like. First day for me, bro, I'm yeah. not trying to like fall in love with her, you feel me? Like, I'm just You're trying to get to know her a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. You're know? having a good time, yeah. yeah. Right, have a good time, feel the vibes, have a good energy, and see yeah. if you get that attached. You know, then you, you dig it, to, you take it from there. Like, you know, next day, oh yeah, you might be love, more lovey dovey. You feel me? Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's around, you know. Yeah. First dates are all the problem. If y'all can't even vibe on the first day, like, you don't go out, don't go out, don't go out. It's gonna be real don't fucking it. awkward, bro. Like, Pretty fucking much, bro. Bro, honestly, saying, whenever I have a rule in my car, Right? If I'm hanging out with a female or something, if you not if you gonna turn up, turn up all the way. Like I wanna hear you singing whatever you're fucking playing, right? right? That's how I get one, that's how I get them out of their comfort zone. Yeah. Right? Like that little bubble that that little awkward bubble. And then two, she gets to know me a little bit better. Like, hey, he you know, he's chill, he can jam out to music, you know, he he vibing with me and everything. And then after that, you know, we definitely get into food. <laughs> Cause I'm you know, 
Yeah. Yo, something. I love food. This, this is one of my probably biggest pet peeves and probably only pet peeves. If we're on our first date, or if we're on, like, doesn't matter, any date, yeah. if I'm ordering a juicy <clears throat> burger or even, like, a large pizza for myself and you're over there ordering a uh, house salad, so, yeah. now nah, we ain't going out again. Like, you're just trying to be fake. Like, you're ordering that house salad, but you still want to take my pizza home. Like, why don't you just eat with me? It's okay. I'm no, not going to no, judge no, you. No. I already have a large pizza for myself. I can't really judge you. I feel like some girls just have, like, really hot snacks. Really like high. Him. Explain. What you mean? What do you mean by standards? Uh, standards, bro. Uh, like, like they just expect the, they just expect you to put them on the pedestal and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Basically. Yeah, yeah. Basically, like basically what that means. Queen, yeah. You know, like, I mean bro, that's how, that's the whole that generation that today. You know, right, everybody right. want to be treated right, and yeah, it's like it's, I feel it's just because of bro social networking. Bro. Yeah. We have set standards for ourselves, and like we want to show like oh we living our best life doing all this shit. You know, mm-hmm. not like so oh, we can be all so we can all be accepted by each other, and that's not right. I feel like we should be accepted for yourself. Exactly. Yeah. I love that. And most I love people, that topic actually. Yeah. So do well, you definitely. think society is, has changed because of social media? Like oh, before, yeah. before, yeah, before we did not give a shit about like what we look like. We, no look like. we could be okay, growing up, this one is <laughs> bad as shit. Not gonna lie. <laughs> we didn't care. Yo, growing up, we used to have challenges. I can't laugh. I can't laugh. We used laugh. to have challenges picking this guy up. See yeah, who can pick I, him I can't up. laugh. You have, a, you have an antenna right now. You don't have the Shit. colors in the back. Yeah. So you don't have, have no HDMI. Bro, yeah. you think kids play like yeah. fucking Monopoly and like board games and shit? Now? Bro, I don't even think Uno is nowadays. Yeah. Like, that's what we grew up on. And like, the Bro, I grew up on Sock City. What you mean? The what? Bitch, Ludo and shit? Uh, oh, we! Yeah. Bro, that's so old. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, we be back, playing like, is just some puppy now. Like, kids or teens or whoever, not even teens, are like more <laughs> influenced about what people look on the social media and try to see, like, I need to look like that. And if I don't look like that, I'm like going into depression and like something yeah. wrong with me. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, saying I agree with that because people do do that a lot. Um, nowadays, people feel like, yo, if I don't look like him, the society is going to judge me. They're not going to like me, you know, like nobody's going to, I'm just going to be alone by myself sitting yeah. underneath a freaking most water people, fountain. Most, most people feel like that sometimes. Yeah. People have a personal image for themselves now. Mm-hmm. And I feel like just sets the standards way higher. Yeah. Like nobody's even going to, like you see females even go to the gym with makeup. Bro, like, yeah, what's the point of that? Yeah, large enough, bro. Yeah, I know. I mean, bro. I kind of like playing fitness, bro. Oh, like, yeah. You know, them single ladies, you know, they try to show, they try to show the themselves. Gym, man. I, I, I mean, like, the gym, that's fine. Like, like, if you're working out, you're gonna like, like, tell me that man don't. Nothing. Like, bro, you're not gonna go to You're gonna tell me that man don't bag no girls, like, in the gym. Like, y'all, no, no, okay, yeah, we do, we do. Not gonna lie. Right. But at the gym, bro, honestly, saying that's where I see the true side of you. That's where I see your natural side. I don't wanna see your fucking fake you know ghosty side and no. that's because bro you see all these instagram models who be making these videos and then working out with mm-hmm. all these makeup on bro they don't even fucking work out they just splash some water on their face and oh my goodness guys look i did my full 30 that, 30 yeah. minute fucking cardio yeah, the that's fuck? what i'm talking about 30 yeah. minute cardio i can barely do 10 bro bro i can barely do five <laughs> <laughs> no but yeah it actually society has changed a lot like what we look at yeah, and how we grew up and what has changed now like even like even now, I was looking at tattoos, like, do I need a tattoo? No. Is it going to make me any better or cooler than no. the rest of the people? No. Like, why do I want a tattoo? Oh, because it looks cool. Because somebody else has it. Like, that's what we think right. now. Like, I'm saying me too. Like, earlier I showed you guys a tattoo I was thinking about. Like, do I need it? No. I'm probably going to get it. Probably not. But it's just... <laughs> <laughs> He's like, probably not. My, my dad going to whoop my ass. Yes, like, yeah. I just showed you that tattoo. I ain't going to but I think tattoos have been around long enough for like I don't think really like I think I I, I, I think people more no, it's more acceptable. I, I, I feel like, like my example though that's just because I was just doing that I was just yeah. buying that. I feel oh, like man. the idea of getting tattoos is like you know if you, you just you know of course like most people get tattoos because they, they, they have mean purpose something. means something yeah. to you so whenever you just, you know feel you have something that means a lot to you you just want to get that. That's the time that you should get it, cause that's how people get it, and they regret it later. You know what I mean? If they don't like it, if they look bad or whatever, they just cover it up, or they just complain about it their own life. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Too, true. You guys, Me, you guys have any fucked up tattoo stories? Yeah, nah, no, that's, that's all. Oh, that's over my chair. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
I just heard a pop too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's cool. Uh, I have a channel about that. I exactly do little quick stuff, but I mean, it's not finished. What, what is, is it? Have, it's the Hulk. <laughs> 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 you have a green Hulk on your side? No, it's, it's not even somewhat. green, bro. Can't. Oh, tough, tough. It's just yeah, a, it's not even colored in. It's not even colored in? No. no it's it's not just black? No. Like, just ink? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, bro. You gotta get that colored or something. Yeah, it's been like. Yeah. Yeah. Wasn't the last time you came to AZ, right? Yeah. yeah. Hey, well, how'd you, like, how long did that tattoo take, though? Uh, just that one? Yeah. I think, like, four hours. Four hours? Yeah. What, Damn, for what really? made you get the Hulk? <laughs> Let, let's just say that. I used to be, like, a really angry kid. <laughs> I feel like, like, I don't know, I used to hold a lot in. So hold my grudges like, and everything? Yeah, so I just kind of felt like, like that. I kind of related, in a way. But I don't know. Now that I look at it, I'm like, fuck, that's not me at all. <laughs> that was the most bullshit excuse I heard yeah, yeah, for a whole yeah, tattoo. Yeah, <laughs> Stick yeah, yeah, it out. Yeah. We get the real answer. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, 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 it's like, the whole nigga. I'm, I'm hot, like, tattoo, angry for some reason. Yeah. It's all dude. Was that your first tattoo? No. Oh. Excellent. But, that's first tattoo was actually good. Like, first tattoo mistake. So, like, or they're drunk and they just get like the I don't first think tattoo. So. Because people were like, they think about their first tattoo more than no, they think about their tat, Some people just end they up with tramps on their back. Oh my god. <laughs> no, oh, they, I feel like you, you think about it more than you'll think about your second or third yeah. tattoo. Because then it's like, okay, you already know what it feels like. You've been through it. You can get rid of anything. I don't think I can do the pain. I honestly, it's I, not bad. It's not bad. It's a pain that you kind of like. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah. It's, it's, it's going to be like, once you get that first one, you're going to go, right, I'm going to do another one. It, for real, like, and I'm not even gonna lie. It's like, like it's like going on. There's a, a like, spot a that that the front coaster. is gonna hurt, but that's common common sense because you know the area is really sensitive. Yeah, soft so skin, yeah, it's soft skin. So like for me, like man, I got I got full sleeve. So what it hurted me the most, like kind of like under my wrist. That, yeah, I heard that hurts the most there, and then it's like kind of like right here, like, you know, when you pretty much yeah, you got donate blood and stuff. So, you want to yeah. show you want to show us your sleeve real quick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's we'll see. Hey, say, so sleep. Yes, All the way around. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am about, about to get naked on there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Live and shit. He's like, nope. I'll keep it. Like, I'll keep it. 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 I'll on the pain or not? I feel I feel like lightheaded once. I feel like you know, like I was just like, damn, I need to take a break. Cause that's the one I was doing my back tattoo. That was like 13 hours straight. We just oh we God. was just right there. I, I remember I had like I got fried probably got blow too. Then <laughs> you know what else? So what's Shit. the best tip to like? How do you how could you like prepare yourself? Drink a lot of water. Drink a lot of water. Drink a lot of water. That's a, that's a, that's one and major don't, thing. Don't take any painkillers before. Yeah. Yeah, well, I ain't what gonna lie, I did that. I did, I did, I did that, that too. I took an ibuprofen, like, yeah, and that shit, like, my tattoo artist told me, like, yeah. you bleed uh, more. Yeah, if you, you bleed, bleed more? more? Yeah, yeah, I bleed more and shit. And it was kind of true, but at the same time, I he felt good, so I was like, man, let me just knock it out, you know? Yeah. But, and also, eat. Like, that's another thing. If you if you don't eat, yeah, you're gonna be bugging. You're gonna be like, <laughs> bugging. You're gonna be bugging, yeah. for real. See me personally, if I get a first tattoo, it has to have to mean something. Like it has to have like a deep ass meaning because I can't just you know get a shit on your arm. Yeah. Every Indian. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like Ovi. <laughs> what? I have one too. Yeah. A shit. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all yeah. yeah. seen it? Yeah. See? Yeah. It's yeah. just like right here, I think. Just right. chilling on one. Yeah. Ti- uh, tiger, a tiger lion. Tiger lion. Yeah. Oh, you do? Yeah. He has Kobe too. The Kobe one's pretty sick. Kobe one's dope. I mean, I wouldn't tell you to show it, you know, you would have to take everything yeah. off. Yeah. <laughs> you good. Yeah, you good, bro. <laughs> Respect after Kobe. That was a good tattoo. That was, I just saw it like a couple days ago. I didn't even know you had that. Yeah, that shit was cool. No, I don't lie. I have something in mind. What's up? So, <clears throat> once you're like... Okay, should celebrities... I don't know how else to put it. Should celebrities have YouTube pages? Like, should Stages. they have their own, like, page and everything? They're already making shitload of money. They're already doing everything. I mean, should they be like doing like, like people want like shit. a behind the scenes type thing? Yeah, if everyone that's was real. Yeah, yeah that's real. Yeah, yeah. Well, YouTube's not, a pretty big platform at this point, but it's more in depth. It's a whole different. There's like you view YouTube and Snapchat and Instagram completely different. Fact, you know? like YouTube, like Instagram and Snapchat. Some people, honestly, saying older generations they don't have. Yeah. 
all that stuff. They don't really like to keep. And there's some old people, old fashioned people that are don't like to. Uh, what's it called? Have like social media, like but Facebook, I, Instagram, but I think Snapchat, if you're, all I that. I think if you're an older generation, you're not coming to Snapchat, Instagram, or anything. You're sticking to Facebook. No, you're sticking to YouTube. YouTube is the, like YouTube. YouTube and what's up? It's for think, everyone. I think the older generation, like with, I can speak with Indian generation itself, but I think the older you get, you start to stick to WhatsApp and Facebook. Mm-hmm. So you definitely get Desi, you get Daisy videos WhatsApp. from WhatsApp, then you forward them to other group chats, and you get more stuff from there. I YouTube think that's just a platform for everyone. Yeah, I feel like YouTube just everyone. Gaming, music, and fashion. YouTube is like Google. Yeah, yeah too. facts. Yeah. You feel me? Another thing, yeah, I feel like they it's cool that they have it just because nothing is forever. Let's just say they're acting and then something happens and their acting career just goes away. And you'll see it because it's like back, like, you know, two, three years ago, people used to uh, film pranks all the time. Yeah. But you don't see that anymore because it's like, they died, 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 died down. down. That was a but then trend. another trend starts up and people start making music about that. Did you know? about the cheese one? What? We're hitting the baby with the... Oh, the cheese? Slides. Yeah. <laughs> That's all stupid, bro. That's cheese, all stupid. Like, you never seen it? You guys, you gotta pull it up, bro. You gotta show us. Bro. Hey, that's my that's boy Puda Log, by the way. Y'all didn't catch him on the last video. Check out his um, YouTube video, you know. His song came out. Put your heart into it. Shout out my boy Puda Log. We got cheese on baby face, bro. Of course, the first one, one bro. Jeez. Amazing. You ain't seen this, Pablo? No, I haven't seen this. Yeah, it's really stupid, bro. Right. Yo, this is this is a new trend. Like yeah, people are trend, yeah. hitting their babies, hitting their babies. Yeah. What's going on, bro? What cheese? Oh, it worked. Let me tell you what we're Look. Did <laughs> you just stop crying? Wait. Like that's what people are doing nowadays. Throwing cheese at people. Okay, is there a funny one? <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> that's the new trend nowadays. That they are throwing cheese. And put the interview on Kelly. <laughs> Kelly, I oh, saw Kelly. that, bro. Yeah. You guys want to see that one? Yeah. You guys want to talk about it? Right. Yeah. You guys want to see the full? No, just no we just watch a glimpse. Yeah. Clear. Yeah. Oh, that's full seven minutes. Oh, <laughs> oh, it's getting real. <laughs> Is that the one where he cries? Yeah. I mean, serious? Yeah. No way. Oh my god. Oh, are you watching like a news thing, bro? Yeah. yeah. Just click the top one, the top. Crying. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Don't watch the one that's like 1K views, bro. Yeah, that one, that one, that one. Which one? Which one? I've never seen these. These are alive. Right. Would To hold somebody, <laughs> let alone four, five, six, fifty, you said. Why, how stupid would I be to do that? I didn't say you That's were holding That's stupid, guys. I didn't Is this camera on me? <laughs> <laughs> stupid. Use your common sense. <laughs> Don't forget the blog. Forget how you feel about me. Hate me if you want to, love me if you want, but just use your common sense. How stupid would it be for me to, with my crazy past and what I've been through, oh, right now I just think I need to be a monster and hold girls against their will, chain them up in my basement, and, and don't let them eat and don't let them out unless they need some shoes down the street from their uncle. Stop it. Y'all quit playing. Quit playing. I didn't do this stuff. It's not me, I'm fighting for my life. Bro, what the Damn. fuck is that? Yeah. Oh. He just like, how he described with all that, I feel like, man, I don't know, Kelly. He just kind of like gave him. <laughs> you know, like, yeah. that went full on him. Like, there's so many memes about him. Yeah. It's not even funny. It's pretty funny. You said it's pretty funny. Yeah, you yeah. yeah. can't like, say like, that. Everything, like the Michael Jordan meme. You know, internet savage. Uh, uh, internet savage. <laughs> that should be funny, bro. Like something that just take off within 24 hours. It's trendy. Yeah. 
catch me outside went off. I'm like, but that, that was that was like stupid that was shit. Stupid. That was stupid, bro. And she, she became, became she fam- bro. She became famous off that yeah, shit. Yeah. She had billboards, bro. She had she had billboards, she had, like, bro. She has like she had a fucking song off that shit. Yeah, bro. bro. Yeah. Like, catch me outside. How about that? Yeah, the y'all. They, <laughs> did y'all know she started rapping now? She started rapping. rapping yeah, yeah, you yeah, haven't like seen that, bro. Song. Yeah, she she, oh, she has like she has like like some like popping people like with, on their songs sometimes too. It's kind of weird. That's I, see something about internet is I love it and hate it at the same time. You can be viewed from anywhere in the world. Like you can be looking at Catch Me Outside probably got like I don't know. Everyone probably saw it. Yeah. yeah. That's just crazy how the small the world has gone how we can connect with everybody and just with a click away yeah, yeah. That, that's what i'm talking about youtube is for everyone literally not just youtube with everything just, technology just phones, phones bro phones just in general yeah. it's just direct you can have that anytime <laughs> Like Pablo right now, and just chilling on his phone. Oh, my fault, man. <laughs> just totally got, forgot his phone. He got dark. Just yeah. on his and he just got a crazy ass test message. That's crazy. It's cool. That's, That's cool. what happens, man. Some, Some bullshit. So, what are you up to now? Do you have anything coming up? Anything new? What are your. Let's talk about your achievements. What have you accomplished playing overseas and things like that? Well, playing overseas, uh, I was fourth leading scorer in the La Plata, you know, in the league of Spain. So. I can Google that, you know, as well. I won two championships in college, you know, uh, conference. Uh, MOP, I was the most outstanding player of the year, so that was a blessing. And uh, went to the March Madness twice. Uh, apparently, we fell short both times, but glad I, I got to get that spirit, you know. So. When did you go to March Madness? What uh, year? 2017 and 2018. Hey, so pretty recent, yeah. Yeah, back to back. That's good. Yeah. Any big plans for upcoming seasons or anything like that? Um... Big plans, just get better myself, trust the process. I know it's like, you know, it's a it's a long season. You're still young, man. You yeah. have a long way to go. Yeah, I still got a long way to go, but at the same time, you just want to make it happen. So yeah. take that patiently and then just be humble, stick with the game. Are you still going to be playing uh, Spain next season? Uh, I'm not sure about Spain, but I'm looking for something better. But if okay. I can get Spain, obviously I'll take the opportunity. Okay, okay. Nice. nice. What about you? Do you have anything coming up? No, man. You're just chilling? Just school, work. Let, let the people know how they can catch you. Hey, if you guys want to play Fortnite with this kid, he's cold as fuck. Mm. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> There's more people. Okay. He plays, he plays, mm. he plays, obviously. I don't play, I just die. I'm, I'm, the, first one. I'm, I'm the first one to die. Mm. I'm the first one to die. So this guy will pretty much carry you. If you are up for a challenge, he will carry you. He can have easy 10 kills a game. Cool. Shout out to Ivan, because he low-key destroys me on play. Man, it's, it's crazy how that game took off too. Yeah. It just yeah. went viral. I didn't even know about that game. First, NAR downloaded it. He was like, just download it on your computer or your PS4. I was like, I'm never going to play. I don't play games. Yeah. I played it. It was stupid at first. When did you start? Like, what season? Season, I don't even know. Eight? No. We no, we it was seven, 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 eight seven, hit seven, like seven. a week ago. Seven, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's not even man. seven, bro. Like, we started playing back in like season five, bro. Yeah, no so way. probably like four or five. Yeah. No way. Yeah. Yeah. We, we? Yeah, we started Damn, playing we at Sunny's house. Cause, uh, yeah. We were at Sunny's house. <laughs> uh, I'm still not good at it. <laughs> I think it was after December, because I got. came to. I came from India in December, so it was after that. Yeah. So whatever season that was, I don't, I don't keep up with that shit. Right. <laughs> yeah, so I'm pretty much. I'm, hey, on record, we, I'm ass. Game blew up. Yeah. Hey, we talking about games, you know, we got the bigger gamers oh, right here. Oh, God. Yeah, wait, 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 okay. Fortnite or. Fortnite or uh, Apex? Apex, bro. Apex. I, I, I just like Apex so much, bro. You did? Oh, yeah. Like, I understand how. Faster, it, it loads faster. It loads way faster, <laughs> yeah. I'll say that. But I don't know. Fortnite, you're just sitting there. Yeah. Like, Fortnite's the only game OV is better than me. Like, I just can't get it down. Bro. He's challenging. Like, get off B, bro. Madden. Keep oh. first. Bro. All right, FIFA maybe, FIFA Madden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, no, we can, we can, we can turn on two Panama, out of bro. You from yeah, Panama? Yeah, they ain't Panama, yeah. yeah. bro. No worries. You're too hard on FIFA. <laughs> yeah. Y'all got FIFA? No, I don't got FIFA. I got two K. Oh, I already I know. Madden. I already know. Bro. I got UFC. You t- Let's get it. You have yeah. everything, everything, and anything besides FIFA. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Besides what? Besides FIFA. <laughs> Besides FIFA, oh. yeah. Yeah. Never played it. You never played FIFA? Yeah. We were playing yeah. it in Canada. Bro, like, bro, if, if you if you want some tips, don't buy any new, like, 
sports games because they're all like it, it's nothing new bro, at all. I haven't bought a $10 what? title pass FIFA you know, bro, like, but like NBA like 19, it, it's all right, best, but like, but bro, a, 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 moves, NBA 18, like, NBA 18, it's garbage, easier to bro. make, like, to do now. Okay, I understand that, but like 2K18 is like garbage, bro. The only reason we bought it is because we were stupid enough to buy it, basically. And so were you. But. Fuck you. <laughs> hey, fuck you. Well, yeah, 2K19, we 2K19 updates and all that, like the park and how, what else you can do, yeah. like all the type of stuff. That's, I feel like that's the upgrade, but you know. 2K19 is worth it, man. Like, <laughs> that's like the best game right now. All right, we're going to end it on one topic, like one. I just need one answer. I mean. You, you, and you. Oh, and explain why. Oh, Sip. this is the last topic we'll talk about in this today. I'll go first. I'll go first, bro. Except, except for like, yeah, except, except for like chosen, bro. It really sounds like complete hot. And like, I'll say, I'll say, I'll. What are you talking about? Let the audience know. Sid, dude, I already said Sid, dude. Yes, bro. Okay. Probably because I'm more into like the like the hardcore rap stuff, and he'd be rapping just like straight up like murder. And stuff like that. <laughs> so I'm just like, I, I, I dig it, bro. It's pretty damn cool. So do you, bro. But I ain't talking about it. He's just more relatable with everybody. Like, his last song was good. Yeah, no, like no. people in Canada and America say can relate no. to his music more. He can like play both roles. Like he can, he has some hard ass shit, and he has some shit like you can just play in clubs, you know. Like jam and shit. Yeah. yeah. But I think Canada's big on like Sidhu, bro. Bro, like, yeah, y'all told us that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, India's big on Sidhu. Dude, bro. Like, I mean, India and Canada are almost the same. Solid desi, solid desi, kate kate. Brampton. Man, <laughs> Brampton. 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 Yeah, right. Literally, like, all they listen to is, is freaking Sidhu. But honestly, saying me, I would say. Oh, Especially that last couple songs that we yeah. had, bro. Kar- Kar- I, I'd say, yeah, Karn. Karn's Kar- Kar- doing good. Like, he, both of them doing good, honestly, but Karn, yes, I can, yeah. you could relate to a little bit more, pretty much. Yeah. What See, about I'm you? One Sid the fan. I mean, I'm a. Yeah. Uh, yeah, exactly. Come on. I mean, exactly. I'm not saying. I'm not like, saying. Yeah. Sidhu, Sidhu has some well, good music, but right music. now, I think Karn has a market. Yeah. He has, like you said, relatable songs. It's not like all. Mandamarke. <laughs> <laughs> it's all hard songs. You have like probably. songs that you can relate to and things like that. But yeah, they're both gonna go off. But right now, I think it's current for me, and that's just my opinion. Being right. right. And we can all have different opinions. Music, so. but exactly. They're all, they're both good. It's right. just my opinion. But on that note, that will be our last, or not last, Ooh. but that will be. We didn't ask Pablo, bro. That's Pablo, bro. Pablo, bro. I mean, I don't even know. So, any mini, my mini, 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 Okay, how about I can play it? You I can play each song for you. Here, here, here. Oh, yeah. All right, bet. I got it. That's even better. Here, can I turn it on, please? Bro, if you're playing Sid, do play a good song, bro. If you play Chosen. <laughs> how was your guys' experience on the podcast? I know this is your first ever interview podcast right yeah, yeah. Well, well not not interview but like you know like it's a podcast, podcast it's pretty much yeah, yeah so it's different it's so my first hey, time ever so I, I feel a little nervous i ain't gonna lie i feel a little nervous <laughs> hey, how about this, Pablo? Time, like, after your next season you have to come back too okay i'll do all that right. yeah let's do it all, all right. right so when your next season's done you come back we'll do a one-on-one with you we'll talk about all basketball okay that'll work Let's do it. Y'all gotta do your research. Oh, yeah, honestly. Yeah. Well, I, I, At I, that time, y'all know. I'm not even worried about that. I'm not even be like, bro, Kobe's a good. That's it. Yeah, he's just gonna say like Kobe's. He's talking <laughs> No, but now he's on LeBron right now because he's on the Lakers, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see. Alright, this is Sidhu, right? I'm a forward. <laughs> Alright, you don't have to, there's not a rule, but you don't have to. It just happens. Oh, yeah. uh, and then this is Karn, alright? <laughs> this is Karn. This one? I got it. Oh, yeah. 
I thought this boy about to say super bowl. I can't lie, I'm 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 I'm, that B, I'm, I'm just all by myself. I mean, yeah, like you know what I'm saying? Like the other ones like that's just to hype me up. Like you can yeah. always listen to this. <laughs> there you go, guys. Yeah, right, there man. you go, we have it right there. You know? Alright, ladies Damn. and gentlemen. That was Sing Bros TV podcast. It was Random real talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real talk yeah. pretty much. Um, real talk over here, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's your boy Nor. We got, got the Simron here. We got the Simron here. We got the here. Simron here. Now, play. Like, Simron. Hey, we really appreciate you guys coming out. No joke. Uh, Thank you for coming out. Yeah, I definitely appreciate it. Time out of your day to be here with us. No problem. No problem. Hey, no appreciate problem. it. Much love.